Smartphones have come a long way since their debut and have been working tirelessly towards making lives easier for everyone. Some of these smartphones even pack specs and performance that would rival an ordinary computer or downright exceed them at times. With that, there also lies the option to relieve yourself from the mundane, boring and default audio profile your smartphone provides in favor of a more detailed, resonant and high resolution audio output. However, this does require a bit of tinkering to work and in our video today, we'll talk about how you can turn your everyday smartphone into an effective and powerful high-res audio player. So without further ado, let's begin. Are you struggling to explain your idea? Your audience is not getting what you're trying to say. An animated explainer video is a perfect solution for you. Explainer video simplifies any complex ideas through engaging animations, transitions, voiceovers, and meaningful scripts, which all together create a fun experience for any viewer. And here comes Ten Studio, a team of skilled professionals dedicated to creating engaging explainer videos. With over thousands completed projects, we have the expertise to create explainer videos that break down your message and connect with your audience. Get in touch with Ten Studio today. First things first, the definition. What is high-res music? Albeit complicated to explain without being technical, high-res music is, in a nutshell, the equivalent of watching a movie in 4K while listening to music in low-res feels like going back to 144p or anything equivalent. The simplest definition of high-res music is the way the artist intended a listener to enjoy the music and that's saying a lot. But in order to experience this sonic bliss, how do you get your smartphone to act up? Well, let's start with a streaming platform like Spotify for instance. Even if you have a premium subscription, Spotify streams the music at 1 by 8 of the sound quality produced from the CD, the quality that's commonly known as lossless audio. So anyone who's accustomed to Spotify or YouTube music, imagine the increase in quality in the full audio potential. To achieve that, first and foremost, you'll need access to high-resolution or lossless audio files which typically come in WAV or FLAC format. And get yourself accustomed to a supporting streaming service such as Tidal, Cobas, or Apple Music. After that, all that's left is to enable it from the app settings, however, that's only the tip of the iceberg, as you also need a medium to enjoy high-quality music and ordinary audio accessories simply won't cut it. What do you do? You invest in a DAC. The sound from smartphones reaches your ears as sound waves digitally. Now all you gotta do is convert the audio to analog format and that's where a dedicated DAC comes in. While most phones and laptops come with their own built-in DAC systems which make good use of the 3.5mm jacks, a generic smartphone lacks a quality DAC and as a result is not able to play music in the highest caliber. Now, if you have an iOS, to use your DAC, you'll need a DAC that has a compatible lightning connector such as an iFi Audio Go Link, which comes with all the necessities you need to enjoy quality music in your iPhone. Simply connect your headphones or preferred IEM to the 3.5mm input of your DAC and hear the difference. This will play the music through the highest resolution available from Apple Music with the option of providing music several levels above CD quality. If you're an Android user, all you gotta do is opt for USB-C while some of the latest models immediately detect it and raise the bar several levels above by default. However, for the older models, you should open your OTG settings and enable OTG USB input, which will allow the dongle DAC to be recognized as an external device. However, you don't always need to rely on wired methods as wireless DACs exist and are becoming more popular day by day. For example, the Estelan Kern XP10 is a solid choice and makes higher risk streaming wirelessly simpler than ever before. Especially since you don't have to worry about things being attached to your phone but acts as a separate device you can carry with you making it more convenient to use when you're on the go. However, there lies a small problem. You see, Bluetooth by itself cannot transmit higher resolution music very well since different codecs allow for different bandwidths. In this case, you should stick to Qualcomm's Aptex HD or LDAC which is relatively close to CD quality with little to no loss in compression or quality. With all that, what DACs should you consider? 
Well, there are a lot of options. You could go for the Chord Electronics Mojo 2, which isn't cheap but will change the way you listen to music forever. However, if you feel like saving it up a bit, you can go for Venture Electronics Abigail or Avani, which is still better than the default audio you'll get from your smartphone, so basically the choice is yours. So that was our two cents on how you can turn your smartphone into a high-res audio player. Do you prefer to listen to music the way the artist intended or are you content with the default values? Do let us know as we'd love to hear from you. And as for everything else, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and hit the bell icon if you want more content like this on your feed. 